What's horrifying is that men's testosterone levels generationally have dropped and every generation are dropping. Mm. We're seeing it with blood tests that we carry out actually in, our, in the clubs where guys in their 20s and 30s have levels of testosterone that are significantly lower. So we're seeing these dropped mm. numbers weirdly at the same time as guys actually are working out more mm. and are doing heavier lifting. It's quite a big trend thing at the moment right now, guys in their 20s and 30s for sure, but it's going hand in hand with these reduced levels. Why are we seeing this big shift in that? A bit like we mentioned earlier, this dichotomy between underdoers who probably are eating too much processed food, not doing effective training exercise. And then we have, on the other hand, people who are overdoing it, over-exercising relative to what they're eating. So that would cover both of what you're saying. We can't say, oh, it's just processed food or it's just whatever, but it is generally, going back to Hippocrates, it's not the right balance for the people, but it depends on the individual, whether there are more in the camp that actually maybe they are going to the gym, but maybe actually then they rush home and have their takeaways and they're watching TV till one o'clock. So maybe that's why their testosterone is lower, or maybe they're in the other camp and actually they're sort of pushing a little bit towards obsession in terms of exercise dependence, in terms of very orthorexic eating habits and, and you know, just protein and no carbs. So it's difficult to exactly say what it is, but I think all of the above is this imbalance.